think that is? Why do you think we are so self-focused on the pain and discomfort and less so on maybe recognizing and focusing on the parts that are neutral or feeling good? You know, Tara Brock, the mindfulness teacher talks about this a lot. And she, you know, she explains this in this really beautiful way. It's like the pain is signaling our amygdala, right? It's signaling that like primal brain, like something's wrong, something's wrong, something's wrong. And I love this other example that she gives, you know, she's like, you could have 99 people give you a compliment. She's like, and you have one person that says something critical to you or something mean to you. And for the rest of the day, you're like, yeah, forget those 99 people who like gave me the compliment. Like my brain is going to singularly focus on that one thing that was said that irked me. Right. And so that's another good way to look at it. It's like, that's actually how our brains are designed. They're designed to like figure out what's wrong and to try to fix it. And so what we can do in this practice is again, creating that expansion, creating some more capacity, creating some more resilience in the system to go, yes, there's pain. Yes, there's discomfort. And maybe, maybe for those of us who are in a lot of pain right now, we can't find anything that feels good. There is no pleasure in our body. Like I'm not experiencing pleasure anywhere. That's okay. And so that's why we go to something neutral. And, you know, I learned this in my trauma training. And I remember at the time thinking this is such a silly example, but the teacher would say, you know, just see if you can find something neutral, even if it's like a little tiny section of your pinky toe on your left foot. And I was like, Jesus, that is so specific. Like, do we really have to go there? But after years of doing this work, it was like, actually, that can be a resource because what we're looking for in that moment is an entryway. And so any place where you can go, that feels neutral. Okay, that feels neutral. That's an entryway. That's, that's the beginning of change.